Brown's Raid. While Lincoln fought to stop the spread of slavery through politics, abolitionist John Brown adopted a more extreme approach. Rather than wait for Congress to act, Brown planned to seize the federal arsenal at Harper's Ferry, Virginia. An arsenal is where weapons are stored. And so it says, an arsenal is a place where weapons and ammunition are stored. Brown wanted to use the weapons to arm slaves for a rebellion that would end slavery. Brown launched his raid in 1859. It was an insane scheme. All of Brown's men were killed or captured during the raid. Brown himself was convicted of treason and sentenced to die. On the day of his hanging, he left a note that read, I, John Brown, am now quite certain that the crimes of this guilty land will never be purged away but with blood. Such words filled white Southerners with fear. If a slave rebellion did begin, it was, a Southern, it was Southern blood that would be spilled. The fact that many Northerners viewed Brown as a hero also left white Southerners uneasy. In this eyewitness drawing, U.S. Marines are shown, shown storming the arsenal at Harper's Ferry that was raided by John Brown and his men. Brown was charged with treason, convicted, then executed by hanging. 